Carl here. Let's teach you how to do some conditional formatting in a table matrix in Power BI. First, we've got to go ahead and create our matrix. So I'm going to expand this across our report view. And I'm going to bring this in. And I'm going to add product category. I'm going to add our region. And I'm going to add our cells. And then I'm going to get rid of my food and spices so it's not outweighted. And then next thing we want to do is we want to go into format our visual. So we go into format our visual and we scroll down here to cell elements. And as you can see, all of these function icons, this is how we do conditional formatting in our table matrix. So let's start with some data bars. So we're just going to turn that on. And now you can see what that looks like in your table matrix. So if you click on this function, you have some more options that you can choose from. And I'll just scroll it over here. So we can show this with just bars only. We can turn that on. And then you'll see only the bars and then you'll see the totals. We can also turn that back off. So we'll just we'll show the show the values for now. And then we have a minimum. We have a minimum lowest value enter whatever that value is or a maximum highest value. Then we have positive bars, which basically can change the color here. So if we want to change this to another color, we can do that here. Or if we want to just indicate anything positive as a green, we can come here and make that green. We can also, if we turn this off and turn on icons, we can play around with the different icon formats. So we can change this style to something like this. So it'll basically give us some, de some default values. So um, we'll just hit OK here. And now we'll see what that looks like with some conditional formatted icons here. Basically giving us icon indicators on each product category and region for the amount of sales made. We also can turn this off and go into font color. Well, we can come here and show where the highest values are, let's just say we like green a lot, are green, whereas the lowest values, let's just make those a, a redder color. And now we are kind of looking at something like this. So we'll see all the lower cells will have reddish, a reddish color, while all the higher cells will have a greenish color. So if we turn that off and go to background color, we can do kind of the same thing here. It kind of creates a table matrix heat map so we can do the same thing here where the higher values are in the green area whereas the lower values are something a little red something like that and we can add a middle color to create a better balance so now we have something like this so now you should know how to do some conditional formatting in your table matrix in Power BI.